As with most Saturday mornings, I found myself lying in bed staring at the ceiling with one thought continuously looping itself over and over inside my mind. I need to get out of here. So I yanked myself out of bed and proceeded to use traditional martial arts to return the bed sheets back to their former glory. Hoi, hoi, hoi. I then made my glorious exit. Oh, and for those of you who are wondering why I drive a PT Cruiser, it's cause I'm a boss. So I figured my restlessness stemmed from a sense of disconnectedness, so I had to get away from all of this hard road, street lights, electric cables, and concrete walls, and find a place that was more quieter, a place that was more natural, a place where I could connect with me, a place where I could find my center. And that's when I came across this beautiful flower shop on the periphery of the city of Bloemfontein, a city commonly referred to as the City of Roses. I figured that watching beautiful plant life be beautiful plant life and do whatever beautiful plant life does would give me that sense of belonging I'd been craving for throughout the course of the entire day. This is how I came to the conclusion that I actually find plant life to be exceedingly boring and entirely uninspiring and I probably needed a bigger, more interesting garden to look at. So I took to the hills in the hope that my answer lay on higher ground. And lo and behold, two roads diverge at a yellow wood, and I... Well, I took the one more traveled on because I'm not trying to get raped on some random hill in the middle of Bloemfontein. And there it was, the biggest garden I could find, like a gargantuan petri dish, with its concrete trunks and its electrical roots. I realized that this was a perfect time for an epiphany, yet nothing came to me. So there I stood, under the terrible burden of destiny, and all I could think was, I miss my comfortable bed. I need to get out of here.